I want to just uh, be close the the life and style hockey in Canada, and that's what I need and what I want. More score because I didn't score a lot last year, and uh, help the team, hard work for the team, and. That's it. Well, you didn't score a lot last year, but you certainly have this year. 39 goals, 81 points, and as I mentioned, you're just uh, six points back of the league scoring leader, Peter Trainer. Last Friday night, Moncton Wildcats with Dimitri Yaskin leading the way, three goals and assists that night. You were the first star, an 8-5 win. That had to be a pretty good feeling. Perhaps maybe your finest game as a Wildcat. Yeah, for sure. Uh, I think so. Everybody was ready for this game. We was really excited because it was in TV and everybody watching this game. And I think we 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 was lucky a little bit because score changes a lot of times yep. and we score in the good time and just was good game and was good for everybody for me too. There seems to be pretty strong rivalry developing between the two teams. There seems to be a lot more talking. Uh, among the players, more chirping, there's more antics going on. Is am I reading that correctly? Is that is that is that happening? Yeah, for sure. That's especially for these games. So it's something like playoffs. Every time when we play against Halifax and uh, these top teams, so that's that's happen and for sure. Are you confident the Wildcats can have a a long and successful playoff run? I hope so. I will be still. I hope will be still a good game and uh, a lot of hits. Big, big game, big fight for two points tonight. <laughs> St. Louis Blues selecting you in the second round. Uh, 19 years of age. Where do you expect to be next year? Uh, we'll see. I hope so. I will be in St. Louis. Uh, I hope so. St. Louis give me a chance and. I can fight for for uh, for the place in in this team.